Yo, what is up YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Kathleen and today I'm bringing you guys a brand new video. Today's video is gonna be quite different. If you watch my videos, I mainly do sit down videos. But today, today will mark my first vlog ever. I was never really comfortable with vlogging in public, but today is quite a special day for me and my family, so let me explain what's going down. All right, I had to sit down real quick because there's quite a bit of explaining to do before we get to the good part. So, for those of you that don't know me, my sister and her kids, my one nephew, two nieces, moved across the world about four, four and a half months ago. And honestly, it was a very hard time for me and my parents because we were with them every single day and we were literally like this. But I was recently informed about a week or two ago that they are actually moving back. So I bet you can understand why I'm so freaking excited and today is actually the day that they are moving back. Today, to freaking day. Today marks the day that they come back. So today is the day that me and my dad are actually driving up to pick them up from the airport. And although this will be a very special moment for all of us, you know, to be reunited again, I had to add a little twist to, you know, make it even better. So let me explain what I mean. My nephew has his best friend that lives here. And unfortunately, when he moved away, he had to leave his best friend behind. And obviously they were both really upset about it. And so I was like, oh man, like, it's gonna be so sweet when they reunite, you know? And my nephew was planning to surprise his best friend with his arrival, like literally go to school the next day and just be like, hey, I'm back. And like, obviously that'd be so cute, like it'd be so nice. And his, I know his friend would probably freak out, like what are you doing here, you know? So, me being myself, I got a message from my nephew and he was like, Kathleen, please don't tell my best friend that I'm coming home. Don't tell him, don't let anyone tell him. I want it to be a really big surprise for him and I don't want him to find out. The only reason that we'd be able to tell his best friend is because they're actually family friends as well with my parents and stuff. So of course, like me being me, I was like, no, nah, like we won't tell him, don't worry. I promise I won't tell him. And we won't, we haven't, and we're not planning on telling him. Today's the day and we haven't told them. But his dad is aware, not his best friend, but his dad. And so I was thinking like, okay, his dad found out, but how cool would it be if his dad came along, right? And we surprised them at the airport, both of them. And I'm saying his best friend would be surprised and my nephew would be surprised. And they'd be basically surprising each other with their rivals. So I was thinking and I was like, okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. What can we do to make this work? Because if we run into them at the airport, what kind of surprise is that gonna be? It's just gonna be like obvious. If they saw me and my dad at the airport, they're just gonna be like, okay, something's up. So <laughs> the plan is, and I think it's a pretty good plan, his best friend's dad is gonna take him to the airport at the same time, and he's just gonna tell him that he has friends arriving and he has to go pick them up and he wants them to come along for the drive to keep him company. The thing is with that though, they won't be able to see us because I told him to stay in the food court. Now the food court is all the way down past the gate. So we will be waiting for my family to arrive at the gate and him and his dad will be at the food court all the way down past the airport. So rundown purposes, They'll be at the food court, we'll be at the gate. They won't be able to know that we're there. Then, when my sister and her kids arrive, obviously we're gonna greet each other, we're gonna get their luggage, we're gonna get ready, and then I'm gonna be like, oh, I really want a coffee from the food court. Obviously, Tim Hortons, everywhere's in Canada. So, I'm gonna go get a coffee, but before we get to the food court, there's a wall, and it's like right by the bathrooms before the food court. And so, I'm just gonna be like, yo, can you guys like wait here for a minute? Like, if you trust me, just wait here. I have to get something because I literally forgot a gift I wanna give to you. Something like that. Or I'll just be like, I need you to stay here because I have a surprise. And I'll just be like, do you trust me? And obviously they're gonna say, yeah, like they're not gonna ruin a surprise. And then when they're just chilling, waiting, I'm gonna go run into his best friend and his dad. I'm gonna act so like out of it. I'm just gonna be like, yo, like, what are you guys doing here? And like, I'm just gonna be like, 
oh, like, I'm here picking up a friend. She's actually coming from, like, I don't know, America or somewhere like that. And I'm just waiting and I'm vlogging the experience because, you know, it's been so long since I've seen her. So they're obviously not going to think anything. It's just going to be like, whoa, what a coincidence. And then I'm just going to be like, hey, like, will you guys come with me for a second? I honestly want to show you guys something cool that I saw down there at the gift shop. Obviously, there's no gift shop down by the gates. It's actually the opposite side. But I'm sure they'll believe me, though because you know you never know there could be a gift shop just down by the gates you know so they're gonna walk with me this is the plan they're gonna be walking with me and I will be vlogging but they obviously won't know I won't be holding it up to my face or anything to make it awkward I'll just be holding it on the down low and then we'll walk past the wall that's literally blocking my family and then we're gonna walk past the wall and when he turns his body that way towards my family they're both gonna see each other and it's gonna be like whoa then I'll Obviously, I will be vlogging their reactions because I think it's gonna be really really cute like they are extremely extremely good friends and you know what I was like instead of him just surprising his best friend why don't I just surprise them both because you know they both won't see it coming it's just gonna be crazy you know so why not add a little double surprise to it you know make their night even better hopefully the reactions are good hopefully my nephew's not too tired from his long long flight I don't know though hopefully it works out I know they're both gonna be so so thrilled though and that's all that matters they're probably gonna be like oh my god like what are you doing here um I don't know I just hope that they are happy afterwards and you know they just have a good time together so this will mark my first ever vlog and I honestly think it's really worth it and I am so 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 freaking excited for the reaction I'm so excited to see my family again uh, it's been four and a half months but it's honestly felt like a year or so but this vlog is honestly gonna be so worth it it's gonna be such a memory to keep and just for my nephew to look back at and everything so I hope you guys enjoy this vlog and if you guys want to see more vlogs let me know but other than that please stick to the end and I will see you guys at the airport Airport. Finally made it to the airport and I just looked up at the screen for arrivals and they have just arrived so stay tuned for the surprise. So we're here right and we're waiting for my nephew, my nieces, and my sister to come down from the departure gates and all you see is them standing by the rail and they go into the bathroom and then my dad's just bent down trying to wave to them. Took my nephew like five minutes to notice him but then he like he waves because he notices us and then he goes and hides. <laughs> my dad has been like that for the past like 10 minutes just because they're literally right up there and they keep hiding. Inside. <laughs> I know and so my dad has been on his knees just looking up at them and the kids are so shy clearly because they keep running away from him and then this dude that works here comes up to my dad and he's like you look like you're trying to learn how to propose because he's on a knee and he's holding flowers <laughs> there's my niece she came down all by herself because she is done waiting with her mom and everyone <laughs> She was so done because my sister and the other kids are still in the bathroom and she said, nope, I'm just going to come down. All right, guys, the fam arrived and as you can tell, they just went quiet, but they were literally talking up a whole conversation about a million conversations all at once. Y'all want to say anything to the camera? Not really. No? Yeah, they shy. Well, they shy. But we are all reunited. <laughs> okay, guys, wait. Wait here, yeah. Yeah, just kind of, yeah, just wait here. It's it's nothing on. really. <laughs> no, there's no one here. Just wait here. If you talk to me, wait. I am on the way to go tell his best friend to come with us. Here goes nothing. I literally can't find them. I don't even I don't even know where they are. Where the heck are they? That's hilarious. I have no idea where they are. They're supposed to be at the food court this whole time. So I'm just gonna keep walking. I am currently outside of the airport because as planned, I went to go to the freaking food court and get them so I can surprise them. And I left my nephew and all of them in the back. And then I go and they're not even there. And then I get a phone call and they're at the Tim Hortons on the outside of the airport. Like, are you serious? <laughs> Anyways, it doesn't really matter, but I hope it works out because now that they know 
that they're waiting for somebody they probably already know that you know the surprise is for my nephew so I feel like it's low-key ruined but I hope I hope it works out I don't know I wish it wouldn't went a little bit smoother but you know whatever a surprise is a surprise and um, I'm sure they'll still be happy to see each other so that's all that matters ended up finding them and here we go <laughs> everyone's surprised <laughs> Oh my god, I thought that was a fail and look at his face man. He is so shocked Okay, surprise. Yes. Yes. No. Okay. Okay Everyone's surprised everyone's surprised. Yo, Jaleel rate this on a 1 to 10 level Yeah, we got that 10. We got that 10. Okay, Oliver rate this 1 to 10 How happy you are right now? Yeah, okay. We got that. We got that I know I was about to, I literally was about to go to Tim Hortons and then all I saw was Oliver run and then I see you in the back and I'm like... <laughs> Alright guys, it was still a success. Although, I really thought it was going to be a fail because they went to the outside airport and then I had to go outside and meet them and then I got in their car and I showed them where to go and park and come in and literally, it took a while. like. 15 minutes. I had my sister and her kids waiting with my dad and I thought it was gonna be a fail Literally literally thought it was gonna be a fail, but they got here and my nephew's jaw literally dropped I know you'll see this footage and it just dropped and I don't know they're so happy together and like my nephew literally looked like he was about to cry He was like, what are you doing here? So it was clearly still a success. Yo, they are so happy The boyfriends are reunited guys. I'm so good. Look at them Literally, doing nothing. I don't even know what they're doing, but they're just happy. Perfect or what? Hey, high five brother, bring it in. All right guys, well that is a wrap for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, it was a little bit of a mess. It was literally all over the place and I didn't think it was gonna turn out, but hey, they're happy. That's all that matters and that was the point of this video. So they are reunited. They were surprised and literally, they actually didn't know that it would be them. My nephew sure as hell didn't think that was my surprise when I told them, I'll be right back, I have a surprise for you. So they are so thrilled and I am so thrilled to say that, you know, it worked out. Oh my God. The lighting in here is so bad because of it's a freaking what's it called? It's a garage and the lighting looks bad and I look terrible. So hey, so without further ado, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to smash that subscribe button, leave me a like, comment down below how you thought this video went, and I will catch you on the next video. Peace. Get in me call. Yeah. No, no, no.